Hi there, lovely people. Good evening from Dhaka, Bangladesh. Today I'm going to be comparing two Beast Mode Sweet Fragrances for this upcoming winter. Uh, I have already covered them side, um, like solo, let's say. Uh, single review I have already done. So individual review you can check on Stronger with the Absolutely and also Scandal Purum. But here's the twist. I did the review on Scandal from a sample, official sample, uh, and I managed to get a full bottle pay full retail and i actually want to show you sort of like an update on this one i have the boxes side by side i have got scandal recent times and stronger with the absolutely like last month or so okay so they're more kind of like my latest purchase so i'll let you know which one uh, is special in which way if it's uh, one is better than the other because both of these are extremely sweet and people who love sweet fragrances these are right up your alley uh, so i'm gonna be uh, accompanied by my trusted coffee i have that uh, nescafe gold very very nice blend and uh, i'm gonna be watching the game afterwards we have a cricket world cup going on semi-final pakistan versus i think who's playing australia right so let's see who wins so i'm gonna show you a few other fragrances when i compare these two and i'll tell you which one is special in which way okay so first of all once again uh, stronger with you absolutely is a flanker scandal is male counterpart of a female perfume okay uh, both of these are very expensive at this moment this one from house of armani you guys know armani doesn't do anything cheap the very first re uh, release from this line was stronger with you i own the whole line stronger with you stronger with you intensely the freeze absolutely uh, this one so basically there are four in the line so i sold off my freeze and the original uh, because i have the stronger one okay so i'm remained with this one which is also good the intensely this is also very very good i kind of find them very very similar in different ways they're special uh, this one goes for i think in market around that hundred dollars price tag so it's not cheap on the other side scandal is a female counterpart of this is more like scandal poor home okay like scandal for men uh, which came from scandal for women this is the edp version uh, this is one of my favorite perfumes hands down okay they have quite a few flankers from this line as well well namely scandal a paris uh so scandal scandal edt and i believe there was this new christmas edition uh right so this feet up and beautiful sweet and you can even tell like they are all like even the strongest absolutely looks like similar to scandal uh these are two big houses one is jean paul gautier the other one is armani uh they both produce mass mass like crowd pleaser kind of perfumes okay so let's go one by one bottle sizes uh, this one i have 100 ml this one also comes in 100 ml i think smaller bottle size are available but you get bigger bottle you'll get more value uh, one other thing i noticed with the scandal they have a refillable bottle which you can purchase and refill this bottle and use this same bottle once again so kind of like the box comparison this box looks really nice i really love these presentations but i think the jean paul is has a little bit more edge over this one in terms of the box okay because this is a paper cardboard this one also same but they have a velvety texture okay i really like this since i didn't show a full bottle i'm showing you a little bit taking my time this full velvety touch really nice very luxurious and the crown looks like sort of like rolex isn't it uh, the side there's the mechanism how to open it even the atomizer can take it out to refill and it's eco-friendly okay and refill is sold separately this is the barcode and all that and these are i think made in spain or what no sorry jean paul gautier it's i think us pui or oh, made in spain yeah i was correct okay so this box is much nicer really i'm gonna keep this box it says scandal and the ad if you've seen it from jean paul's page uh, they actually have very eye-catching campaign going on the bottle i love okay really really lovely bottle sorry Oh man what's wrong with me i didn't show you the absolutely absolutely features this kind of same bottle they all have the same bottle in the line and the juice color is kind of like dark like this uh, chocolatey color uh, i used quite a bit of it and this is dark at the base cap it's really robust really love the cap and the bottle is kind of like a very solid heavy glass base very nice feel to the bottle but the cap uh, it has if you take it out you have Arm emporia armani i think yeah the logo and then the sprayer here spray works really fine i think yeah, I'm wearing it in this hand. Let me show you the spray. Oh, shoot. Sprays wrong places. Okay. Okay. Good, good spray. Okay. So this one, you have to find the right spot and to sit and click. On the other hand, you can like any bottle that you want, but Scandal bottle, I think, looks a lot more special, right? It's a lot more Viva, Diva-like or heavy glass. I really 
dig this bottle and the crown here it it makes that bottle even more special the crown looks like it has a studded pattern on the neck all around okay and uh, here says jean paul gautier i think right i cannot read sometimes my power is not so good uh the cap you take it out it has some weight but not as heavy as i expected but got good weight because this inside got red okay the atomizer here uh, it also has jean paul gautier uh like uh what you call written over the atomizer let's spray this spray is also good on this one okay uh so the thing is one thing i like about the crown if you remember dolce and gabbana the k perfume you know that had also had a crown feature this crown looks much nicer and the bottle looks much better even though it looks like a smaller bottle these are both 100 ml okay so let this settle down oh man this uh evening i went to go for like i went for morning like sorry evening walk i was wearing them like a blend so i kind of like uh, not layer but i wore like uh two sprays each from this perfume two on neck and two on my each arm just to see what happens and that was like really really nice so coming to the comparison okay i'm showing you the presentation everything quickly price point wise candle hundred dollars this one hundred something dollars so very expensive no problem uh if you don't think these are worthy of your money you can absolutely skip it but i feel especially the armani one will very take very long time to go down in price scandal one if you wait for some time maybe it will go down to 70 65 dollars in like year time but that's far away uh longevity both are ultra beast mode okay and if you're thinking i'm comparing them because they are same in terms of smell no i'm comparing them because they're both sweet beast mode cold weather perfumes okay and these are not for people who do not like like sweet fragrance you know these are for people who like massive you know mass crowd pleaser kind of perfumes easy to wear long lasting you know like projects a lot you know you get complimented these are the kind of people who are wearing this but if you find these like sweet ultra sweet if you don't like those this is not for you i understand i respect your uh psychology but uh they are different in terms of smell if you look at the notes breakdown they are not same stronger is absolutely features kind of like a boozy sweet opening it has a chestnut uh note which is this is popularly known for and got this vanilla uh sort of gives this very nice warm you know it's it sometimes people compare this with uh mason martin margiela by the fireplace minus the smoke and that's exactly what you get in this but it's a very chocolatey sweet uh warm fragrance and it's very high class it's almost niche like for me my liking i do love my sweet perfumes this is definitely up there right up there it's like one of those 10 out of 10 fragrances. both are 10 for me okay but i gave this candle nine for a reason that this is not entirely unique so there the difference first difference in between the, the between the two is i found out uh you can find few substitute for scandal but strong with the absolutely this dna you will not find in many perfumes so in that way uniqueness wise stronger takes the cake for uniqueness longevity as i told you both are very close both are very long lasting and even on the dry down they smell on your skin i can get them for a very long time so i would say they are tied for longevity but if you talk about a little bit of projection i think projection wise scandal takes the cake it projects a little bit more stronger maybe last a little bit like one hour more because i think perhaps it's the uh perfume you know they made this concentration absolutely that's what it sticks closer but lasts longer this one lasts long time but projection wise it projects like nobody's business okay so that's the first uh difference so you can find what are the alternatives that you can find stronger the absolutely you can find uh, i would say you can get the by the fireplace uh so far from the ones i tried and stronger with you line intensely the original uh, this kind of fragrances or maybe you can get uh, like i don't know what else but i cannot think of so many fragrances that smells like this dna so i would say only substitute for this one is this lineup the original or the intensely but here you go scandal i'm going to give you some uh like options alternatives you don't have to spend on this one like they're not the same i remind you but they have almost similar vibes i showed you during my uh rooftop video first thing i showed you was this one le beau by jean paul gautier and they are the same house it's no surprise let me remove the box this is the first one you can use it as alternative but longevity wise this will take the cake this one lasts three times more than le beau check out my review on uh, jean paul gautier le beau second one i'm going to show you it's very similar to it it got good performance now but now price wise is a little bit cheaper that is 
this one one million perfume okay by uh pakuraban that's another house that creates sweet fragrances you know like they make sweet and uh kind of like this got solar sort of a effect got this kind of like a salty i don't know what else is in there but it's kind of like a fresh sweet uh, combo uh, you can wear this and it's very long lasting it can be worn colder months uh warmer months anytime but i feel this one million it's really uh very close to this one okay third option i'm gonna give you is similar to that but more lovable and more summer friendly that is one million lucky okay if you have this fragrance this is a compliment galore okay this this juice okay yellow color juice this one has like popcorn caramel popcorn sort of vibe it's really fresh take on one million dna so apart from these three you can get one more option but it's not exactly the same but you definitely get similar sort of fashion perfume that is this bad boy by Karina Herrera this is one fragrance did not get any love in the community whatsoever but whenever I wear it people seem to like the smell it has this freshness it has some warmth it got this, some nuttiness uh, it got this party vibe you know it's like a very a clubbing fun sensual kind of fragrance youthful fragrance with a bold kind of bottle so coming back if you talk about options uh, scandals uh, replacement could have been possible could be possible with a lot more alternatives but absolutely they actually have their uniqueness so uniqueness wise uh, you have to give it to this one as i told you at first so uh, you can sort of like not buy scandal at this moment okay but you can try the other ones okay now in terms of smell uh, scandal it's also sweet uh, the absolutely uh, if you've seen my review it's more like a nutty chestnut kind of like a sweet almost the honey gui kind of like a very thick syrupy this one has some fluffy sweetness you know like i like the scandal one when i smell it it's very sweet it's got this tonka bean you know it's like a very tonka bean heavy sort of perfume and uh if you ask me like the caramel tonka bean um there's like a note of clary sage it gives this sort of like a fresh herbal kick which is the nice the opening is really really sexy you know like this is built to love i said this in my review for both these are built to love so they're very close you know like in terms of likability which one you can wear you can pick any of them you're not gonna go wrong okay at this moment both are expensive but if you ask me uh how much i would rate them i rated scandal as nine and this one is ten right when i reviewed so in that way yeah naturally stronger with you absolutely wins but they both are collection worthy if you like if you have the sweet tooth i have invictus intense i have <laughs> angel share i have a lot of sweet perfumes and that's my uh, love you know i love sweet fragrances versace eros flame so if you are a collector you can collect absolutely both you can layer them you can wear both two sprays or three sprays of this three sprays of this go out and see you will project massively you'll get excellent longevity and you'll get compliments they are like invincible okay even if you wear the one you don't have to wear as a layer okay so they're a tie okay but as i told you those different properties stronger to absolutely would be my go-to guy because this one is very hard to find a clone of i don't know if they made a clone already but this is more unique in the market if that's what you're searching for if you're looking for also sweet fragrance and you like the original scandal for women if you like this line you can absolutely get this women can get this they can wear it it will project so much more than absolutely i'm telling you the intensely here like i have this one projects if you want projector you can get intensely but if you want longevity it lasts the same time as intensely or a little bit more but projects less so scandal is the way to go if you want to project if you want to wear a little bit more versatile the bottle wise it looks like a boxing champion sort of crown you know uh, so this is like an alpha male kind of fragrance okay but at the same time this one has a unisex vibe so it's up to you which one you're gonna call but i will say they are sort of like two of the best winter fragrances i know my brother victor uh he is one of our admins he is going to buy this for for christmas and for good reasons you know so these are the some of the best for winter sweet fragrances do really well so today's winner are joint champions okay i cannot pick one over the other but i told you which one has specialty or which one has uh, some uniqueness so it's up to you try them both and see which one you like okay so that's the uh, comparison video thank you very much for watching i will upload this and uh, try out the other ones that i showed you as well have a nice day i'll see you soon bye bye